Greetings everyone. Agenda of this video is to share my experience at GLS MSCIT. It will be relating educational facilities, infrastructure facilities, curriculum, co-curriculum activities, placement activities and other facilities. My journey at MSCIT revolves around many amazing things which will be expressed further. I used to be a student of PGDCA from GLS University, FCAIT, before pursuing MSCIT. Had honored with best student of the batch by a respected Mr. Sudhir Nanavati sir. It can be thought that staying in the same university and just changing courses keeps most of the things similar, but the case was different here. Let's move a bit of deeper from the start of the year. Talking about the admission days, I believe being a student of GLS University is the wish of most of the students, but there are some criteria to enter. From the scores needed to apply, entrance examinations, etc., till the moment of one to one interaction with respected Herschel Arul Cursor for the path for admission. I still remember that interaction as Herschel Arul Cursor have made me feel positive and welcome at that moment. Initial days. I still remember the first day of college. It was a day where we came to know our respected faculties a bit properly. Many things were new for us, that is, people's environments, classes, <laughs> labs, subjects, etc. As class divisions were there, we tried to make ourselves comfortable with the class fellows of our division. Now, being the front bench most of the times, I had tried to gulp down the knowledge and lessons shared by our respective faculties by listening to them and asking questions when necessary. As time passed, it was seen that groups of friends were made internally. Small activities and related to studies, activities related to studies, as well as not related to studies, used to be done by us. Moments like having meals together, visit to garden, canteen, cafes, etc., were the ones which had enlightened our journey with studies going on parallelly with them but obviously. After some days, curriculum as well as co-curriculum activities started. When I think about activities that I feel happy remembering my participations in them, which can be as follows like, you know, taking responsibilities of collecting names of students groups and sharing with respected faculty members for assignment purposes and more. One of the positive side of this is that I came one step closer to my most of the class members via having the basic interactions with them. Participating in inter-college annual sports meet, I had represented my college in carom competition as well as chess competition. Respected Dinesh Kalal sir, Vishal Narwani sir, with other faculty members were in charge there. We had won bronze medal in carom competition. I was very happy as had represented our college and achieved this position. Now participating in hackathon and being a team leader in that made me learn a lot of things. Respected Rachna Chaudhary ma'am was our team sky. Working hard with my team for two consecutive days and staying awake an entire night was a thing to remember. Professors too were with us in those moments, helping us and guiding us almost throughout the journey. Team members running here and there for asking required permissions, collecting necessary resources, trying to learn new things from one another, taking guidance from prof professors, etc. All alone were memorable. Had also participated in writing articles at different occasions. I was accompanied by respected professors like Jenny Kasotia ma'am, Jyoti Kayadam ma'am in those moments which were as follows. Uh, we published article in GLS Voice, March 2020, our article relating Git, our distributed version control system was published at page two. Published article at Webomatics Magazine, July 2020. Topic was quantum computing and applications, page second and five. Had participated in Cyber Shades 2020, national level tech fest. I was happy as we had achieved first prize in that competition. We had interacted with students and professors from different courses and environment, had meal together, 
and had learned many new things from one another. Most of the times, celebration at days used to be a crucial topic in students' life. From taking permission from professors, deciding type of days, cooperating with each other in those times, fun with friends and classmates, to actually celebrating those days with friends and faculty members, clicking pictures as a memory, having themes according to days, having different activities like gerba speeches at auditorium, etc. Combined was a great part of this journey. Very important skill that is time management. We had learned via things like tasks, assignment, presentations on the topics provided by professors. Groups were made for different subjects, and they have to perform those activities in time. Professors were flexible with us and by our side most of the time, managing all those stuffs with dates of internal and external examination and trying to cooperate with different people and make things execute in the best mean possible was an amazing experience. With all the activities, students are supposed to keep focus on studies as well. With the guidance and support of all our respected professors, I had tried to score as good as I can in examinations too. Moments of my selection at Srivo Company and sharing it with close people and receiving their greetings was memorable as well. Appreciations which are received by all the faculty members during the ongoing journey of MSCIT made me do my best with time. After all the challenges, activities, semester examinations, I think I really made all the right decisions pursuing MSCIT from this college. I will always try my best to do things which can showcase the name of GLS University via my work and personality. During this time of online lectures as well, facilities which we have been provided by the college is appreciated. We'll always be thankful for the positive presence of all the members who were a part of this journey and will be trying to keep in touch for long. I would like to say that live for the moments you can't put into words. With that said, I would like to conclude this video. Thanks a lot. Thank you very much.